The main reason why you can see me now talking to you is because of the detection of photons that are reflecting from my face and are hitting the sensor of the camera I'm using to record this. In a very similar way, Atlas experiment at CERN acts like a giant camera, but is taking pictures of particles that are created in the collisions of two accelerated proton beams. And these pictures carry a bit different information compared to the one taken with digital camera. They tell us something about particles, momentum, charge, and their energy, which is important for later analysis. In 2012, successful operation of Large Hadron Collider at CERN resulted in the discovery of Higgs boson, the last missing piece of standard model. And standard model is our so far best theory to classify elementary particles and to explain three out of four known forces in the universe. And one might think that then puzzle was solved. But there is experimental evidence that our universe is still full of mysteries. And this is driving motivation for many research projects around the world to build new particle colliders and to develop high performance particle detectors. And together, they should bring us closer to the understanding of the smallest building blocks of nature from which all of us, including everything we see and everything we don't see is made of. And this is exactly where my work comes into play. As a PhD student, I'm working on a module building for future pixel detector of the ATLAS experiment. The basic detection element of pixel detector is a silicon sensor whose surface is patterned into pixels. And each pixel is connected to the channel of the readout chip, which is crucial in transmitting the data from the sensor to the PC. And this later allows us to analyze the data. Once charged particle hit the pixel, the signal we get tells us something about very precise position of the particle in a way how pixel hit on a digital camera tells us something about the color. Once we build a module, we have to perform series of tests and these tests are divided into those that confirm that the module we built fulfills geometrical requirements. And also we perform electrical tests that show us that the module we built has a performance uh, that is satisfactory for future detector, detector operation. I hope that the work I do as a PhD student will contribute to the construction of this new pixel detector that will, in a similar way how photography allows us to capture the moment, this new detector will allow us to capture the truth and bring us at least one step closer to the better understanding of the universe that is created for us.